Do you know how suggestible you are? How open to the communicative influence of others? Do you know how easily you are led and how often it happens to you on a daily basis? In his book The Hidden Persuaders, Vance Packard warns us, large-scale efforts are being made, he wrote, often with impressive success, to channel our unthinking habits, our purchasing decisions and our thought processes. Typically these efforts take place beneath our level of awareness, so that the appeals which move us are often, in a sense, hidden. That was in the 1950s. In the last 50 years or so, research in the fields of neurology and psychology has made some amazing discoveries that for the most part have yet to filter into common knowledge. And yet this knowledge is being used to influence us and our decisions on all types of things from the brands we buy to the politicians we vote for. Whilst the governing powers of the past used obvious methods such as bombs and brute force to obtain their goals and manage their stubborn citizens, the methods of the future will be for the most part undetectable, silent and subversive, programmed into our subconscious without us even knowing it. With this in mind, it's now in our own best interest to know something of this knowledge, something of the unmanned gates in our psychological citadel and the ways that they can be breached and taken advantage of. So how can we defend ourselves against these intrusions and manipulations of our psyche? How can we be sure the choices we make are ours and not the result of certain stimuli just beneath our threshold of awareness? What makes us so suggestible and what can we do to guard against it? Mind your mind.